How many of you, you remember that time you told your kid to go clean the room, right? You're sitting in the kitchen, you're like, hey, go clean your room. The kid leaves, comes back an hour later, and you look at your kid, and you're like, did you clean your room? And your kid says, you know what? I memorized what you said about cleaning the room. You look at him and said, that is great. I'm glad you memorized it, but did you clean your room? And your kid looks at you and says, you know what? I got it tattooed right here on my arm in Hebrew. I tattooed it in Hebrew, what you said for me, clean my room. And I did that as a reminder and so that everybody knows. And you look at your kid and you said, yeah, but did you clean your room? We went to a conference and we talked about what it meant to clean your room. And then some guy stood up, blew us all away. He told us how we could clean it more effectively. We even studied the word in Greek. And the Greek word for cleaning your room is cleanio, which means to clean in haste and to clean with much fortitude. And you look at your kid and you said, yeah, but did you clean your room? You know, we simply just need to do what Jesus says. See, God has been telling us this for a long time now, right? He's been telling you what it is that he wants you to do. And you know what, church? He's even backing it up with his word. He's constantly reminding you in his word. And people, people have been telling you over and over and over again, you need to clean your room. He's like, come on. You got to quit just talking about it. You got to quit praying about it. How many times do you need me to tell you to confirm this to you? How many times has the preacher stood up and told you? You need to step up and do what it is that God is calling to you. 